love is very dear to God's heart, uh, so much so that, that the, the New Testament writers would say that God is love. Yet, it introduces another character of God, or nature, and that he is just. He is truth. He is true. Jesus I am the truth, the way, and the life. So, God, on the one hand, God is love and compassion. He is ready to forgive and embrace everyone who comes to him. Yet there is this part of him that has to be, remain true and just. The Hebrew word for love is hesed. It's a long-term, reliable love that is bound by the covenantal relationship. So the closest that we can get in our uh, culture, in our life, would be marriage. On the other hand, faithfulness, bounding in love and faithfulness, is another Hebrew word, emet. Amen is just a trans, transliterated word from a Hebrew language. Amen, amen, emet. And it means that's truth. When we say amen, we, we basically say that's truth. Amen. And that's what emet means, faithfulness, truthfulness. Emmet is a category of what is real. Psalm 85.10. Listen to this. Love and faithfulness meet together. Hesed and emmet. Righteousness and peace kiss each other. That's God's plan. And so we see how on the cross, God's love and his justice, his hesed and his emmet, they meet. Psalm 85.10. And they kiss each other. What a beautiful picture. Beautiful Savior. Beautiful plan. 